Oh my goodness, it's Resident Evil 2. We're gonna, hey, it's good to see ya. Joaquin Bob Neiman says, you want Katie Sheets? Well, she ain't here, you're gonna have to go find her somewhere else. Good to see ya, Donnie, Tyler, John and Molten Amber and Move. Who could forget TV's Move? I'm gonna play Leon first. And I don't really remember too much. Last experience I had with RE2 was the remake. So I guess I'll know some things from recent, but most of it's going to be from old memory. There's easy mode, but I hate just playing on normal. I wish there was a hard selection, but whatever. For Resident Evil 2. 2. How's it going? A bizarre incident occurred in the outskirts of an American suburb called Raccoon City. It was later revealed that the terrible disaster had been caused by the T virus, a mutagenic toxin created by the international enterprise Umbrella Incorporated for use in bioweapon experiments. The Raccoon City Police Department's Special Stars Unit immediately began investigation in the affair. The case was apparently closed, thanks to the efforts of STARS members Chris Redfield and Jill Valentine. But the Umbrella Corporation's experiments were far from finished. Oh, here we go. Look at those polygons. Leon's first day at work. What have we got here? Oh God, <laughs> he looks like a Chucky doll. ago man what a mess what could have done this what was that oh my god what are these things <laughs> all right that's far enough don't move Okay, he shot one people, two people. What's up with that guy? That was a clean hit. Three people, four people. He shot at four people, and he hasn't even gotten at the office yet. Uh, wait, don't shoot! Get down. To be fair, they are zombies, though. We can't stay out here. I'm just saying that's quick. It'll be a lot safer. Got him. On. I arrived in town and the whole place went Rate, insane. The radio's out. You're a cop, right? Yeah. First day on the job. Great, huh? Name's Leon Kennedy. Nice to meet you. Mine's Claire. Claire Redfield. <laughs> Why didn't you turn around? Chris. Oh yeah, she's looking for Chris, that's right. We don't okay. check our rearview mirror in Raccoon City. Box. Sure. There's a gun inside. You better take it with you. Ah! No! Look out! Whoa! You okay? 
still in one piece. <laughs> that maniac's gonna ram us! I mean, the rear view mirror was there the whole time. Claire! Leon! I'm okay. Head to the station. I'll meet you there. Okay. Well, there you go. I forgot that the intro was that long. That's fun, though. They look like mannequins. There's a run button, I'm out of here. The S stands for speed. Hey, Burble Drank. Hey, Stomper. Freeze. Who are you? What are you doing here? Hold your fire. I'm a human. <sighs> Sorry about that. I thought you were one of them. What's going on in this town? Hold on. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. That's cool. I'm just gonna take some of your stuff. Oh. Won't be needing that shotgun, right? Give me a shotgun. Ah, come on. I can get that shotgun. Where? Come on. I'll take damage if I got to. He has stopped breathing. No shit. I want that, though. Thank you. I'm not asking for much. Maybe a few bullets, too. I think that's everything. I remember a little bit. Hell yeah, they want to play basketball. Well, the S stands for slam. Come on. You know they're dead when they... Yeah, okay, he's got a blood puddle. Sprout, sprout, freeze. I'm police. I think I can just run by here, though. Oh, no, I can't. I have to fuck it up. Ah, there we go. I don't have to dispense all of my justice. Do I want to jam? Slam jam. Man, that, that song's fucking catchy. I don't even really like it all that much. I guess you just see it played on TV enough or whatever. And again, this game is like, it's dated in a really good way. Like when I call Resident Evil too dated. Ah, oh, shit, that was my fault. I should have just turned. I mean it in a positive and cl complimentary kind of way. Oh, yeah, I can skip doors in this port, so we'll be skipping doors here and there. It's a smart thing to do. I mean, there's probably an item out there, but forget them. Overrated song and movie. Yeah, I mean... I won't deny that it's dumb, but I mean, it is a cartoon, so, you know. Anything important here? Huh? Oh, well, there's probably something in the bus. I skipped it. It doesn't matter. We'll survive. Ah, shit. No. Ah, I got fucked over by the camera angle. Oh, this is bad. 
I'm saving bullets. But I almost died. And since I picked up stuff, there's not gonna be a Brad. If I didn't pick up anything, there'd be a Brad zombie there. Hey, Mikhail, good to see ya. Playing RE2. We can just skip those guys. Because, I mean, what am I looking at here? I'm good. I'm just a little hurt, is all. I was about to find some first aid. I was expecting to hopefully not get bit at all. That's okay. It's a learning experience. Looney Tunes and basketball is a strange mix. Says the guy with the Sonic icon. How dare the Looney Tunes sell out? Unlike Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh hell yeah, free police bullets. Leon's like, ow my my side. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna check this out first. I will use the computer. Door lock service. All side doors locked. The doors can be unlocked by card key. Okay, I need a card key. I wonder will I get a card key? Where will I get anything? Oh man. Who who are you? Oh, you must be the new guy. Leon. Sorry, but it looks like your party has been canceled. What happened? About two months ago, there was this incident involving zombies in a mansion located in the outskirts of this city. Chris and the other STARS members discovered that Umbrella was behind everything. They risked their lives to reveal the truth. But no one believed them. Not long after that, all this started to happen. Uh, uh. Hang in there. Don't worry about me. Just rescue the survivors in the other rooms. Here, take this key card. You should be able to unlock the doors in the hall with this. Now go. But just go. Fine, but I'm coming back for you. Just hold on. Well, he'll be fine. Let's go get the other survivors. He locked the door. Well, that's okay, I got a key card. Hell yeah, mission complete. This port came with two maxed out saves. I used one of them. So that's my familiarity. Just about past the one thing that everybody knows is gonna happen. I don't know. I ain't blind though. But I mean, how can you play this game blind and have it looking like this? And to mod it. I wish I could play completely blind again. I don't think I remember anything after the star's office. If that's an indicator of how much I remember. Police memorandum. This letter is just to inform everyone about the recent movement of equipment that's happened during the precinct's rearrangement. Safe with four digit lock has been moved from the star's office to the second floor to the eastern office. The first floor, 2236. Okay, 2236. I know a password. It's that simple. Oh, what do we got in the chest? What came with the PC version? Any cheats? No cheats. So there we go. There's that. I think I clicked arrange mode and I got a machine gun. I'm like, what? 
Then I looked up ar what arrange mode was. And it's basically baby mode. Anyways, I know what's happening. Look at him. He even says hi. Now this one got me when I was younger. It scared the hell out of me. Foxy with two bucks says pee pee poo poo. Well, there you go, Moxie. I appreciate you. I appreciate the money. I don't know about the sentiment, but you know what? I'm not here to judge. Although Leon is kind of looking like a Chucky doll. Look out, he's made out of bubble gum. Kendo's shotgun had just enough to take care of that thing. Who would have thunk? That's right. You, <laughs> you should feel sorry. And you will rue the day you messed with Leon Scott Kennedy. This is for sassy. Because he's doing his hip pose. Bitch. Okay. Spade. Okay. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> Hey, that's taken care of, though. Stars. Oh, there's a note. Operation report. Raccoon... Oh, the raccoon police department see the raccoon police department throws me off because it makes me think of a police department employed entirely by raccoons i think they meant the raccoon city police department or maybe they mean the raccoon department okay what is the raccoon police department was unexpectedly attacked by zombies many have been injured even more were killed during the attack our communications equipment was destroyed and we no longer have contact with the outside we have decided to carry out an operation with the intent of rescuing any possible survivors as well as to prevent this disaster from spreading beyond Raccoon City. The details to the operations are as follows. Fucknut with five bucks says, Hey Hellbent, what are you playing this on? And I was playing the remake earlier. This is on PC using the Source Next port and translated into English. It's a bit of a, a few hoops you gotta jump through, but it is a really nice way to play it. I played a little bit just to make sure it worked, and this is much nicer. Because I can skip doors. Anyways. What were we talking about? Yeah, the details of operations from the Raccoon Police are as follows. Security of armaments and ammunition. Chief Irons has voiced concern regarding the issue of terrorism due to a series of unresolved incidents. On the very day before these zombies' attacks, he made... All, <laughs> sorry, I, I, it's throwing me for loop. On the very day before the zombies attack, he made the decision to reallocate all weapons to scattered intervals throughout the building as a temporary measure to prevent their possible seizure. Unfortunately, this decision has made it extremely difficult for us to locate all the ammunition caches, which is pretty funny. It has become our top priority to recover these scattered munitions <laughs> to unlock the weapons storage uh hold on the other thing they need to do is to unlock the weapon storage as stated earlier it will be extremely difficult to secure all the ammunition however considerable supply still remains in the underground weapon storage unfortunately the person in charge of the card key used to access the weapon storage is missing and we have been unable to locate the key one of the breakers went down during the battle and the electronic locks are not functioning in certain areas. It has become first priority to restore the power in the power room and secure those locks. Recorder David Ford. Uh geez. I'm gonna I'm gonna give you the Cliff's Notes versions of these unless you, you know I'll read it. Fuck it. We'll just get through this. Uh 1 p.m. West Barricade has been broken through and another exchange ensued. We sheltered the injured in the confiscation room on the first floor temporarily. Twelve more people were injured in the battle. Recorder David Ford. Additional report. Three additional people were killed during the following 
the sudden appearance of an as yet unknown creature. This creature is identified by missing patches of skin and razor-like claws. However, its most distinguishing characteristic is its lance-like tongue, capable of piercing a human torso in an instant. Their numbers as well as their location remains unknown. We have tentatively named this creature the Licker and are currently in the process of developing countermeasures to deal with this new threat. Weird that he wrote all that down, but all right. That was a long note, huh? Junk. Pistol. Hey, yeah, we got over 100 bullets. It was worth getting hit for. A fireplace, an oil painting hangs above it. The title is A Sacrifice to the Hellfire. I mean, I remember this one. This one's kind of hard to mess up. Oh my god, it's a fireplace. But you've never been to prison? Every prison has a fireplace. Leon hurts. Get out of there, Leon. Like McBain, this is probably the best PS1 game. I can't argue that. Like, as far as sequels go, this one was like a huge step up. Oh, fuck, except in this port, I can skip doors. Oh. Fuck you, bitch. I can't see what I'm hitting, but I'm probably hitting something. Okay, I heard a body drop. That's good. Okay, they're probably mostly dead. Okay, that one's definitely not mostly dead. Bleed. Okay, he's bleeding. We're good. Ah, fuck. He got me. That's just more bullets I get to save. Yeah, countermeasures for the liquors. <laughs> like, shooting it. Driver's got it. Okay, we're over here and I hurt. I probably don't need the red jewel right now. And the shotgun is empty. Probably won't need the knife. I'm gonna put that away too. Because I got a whole lot of pistol ammo. I'm mainly just in pain. Leon hates his greens, but he's gonna have to... Oh, shit. That wasn't even a fool. I forget what lays ahead, but it, it can't be too bad, right? They'll probably throw me some herbs, whatever. I'll eat both. I'm good. We'll just check out the dark room and save. I forget if there's anything here. Nope. I can save my typewriter. I'm keeping those max saves, though. It's cool that the port comes with those. It's like, hey, here's some maxed out saves just in case you can't be bothered. That's fun. I haven't had to resort to them yet, but I hate to throw them away since, you know, they're nice enough to give them to you. Doing even an ammo cheap? Nope. <clears throat> no cheats. I don't think that'll be necessary. This game's hard, but it's not like, you know, it's not impossible They give you a lot of ammo. I think uh, they, they're like, oh, maybe Chris's campaign from one was a little bit rough. Can you solve the puzzle? The S in Scott Kennedy stands for smart. And shove. Leon smart shove Kennedy. Why 
Why do people say I look like a Chucky doll? Is it because of the way I walk? I solved the riddle of the red jewel. I've taken the red jewel. Skipping the stairs. Just go, go, Chucky, get him. Put that jewel back with the other. It's probably not even necessary. But it's safe now. Nothing can get in there but Leon. And sometimes Claire. Michaela, I did see the added nemesis of Dead by Daylight. I'm excited to check that out. riddle on how to continue the Redfield bloodline. Oh no, I don't think I'm ready for that one. believe he's dead but it doesn't matter we're going in here did i get the special key nah i picked up uh ammo and stuff on the way in because i'm a baby uh shit i don't think i should take the shotgun doesn't this affect claire's playthrough let's just leave it in there for now i already have a shotgun so claire should probably Get that right? I think. I forgot what I can leave for Claire versus Leon. But I mean, if I already got the shotgun by Kendo and I'm leaving that shotgun there, giving it the old Becker. Well, not Beckers. I'm sorry. Claire. Chris's diary. Let's read Chris's diary. August 8th. I talked to the chief today once again, but he refused to listen to me. I know for certain that Umbrella conducted T-virus research in that mansion. Anyone infected turns into a zombie. But the entire mansion went up in that explosion along with any incriminating evidence. Since Umbrella employs so many people in town, no one is willing to talk about the incident. Looks like I'm running out of options. We've been receiving a lot of local reports about strange monsters appearing at random throughout the city. This must be the work of Umbrella. With the help of Jill and Barry, I finally obtained the information vital to this case. Umbrella has begun research on the new G-Virus, a variation of the original T-Virus. Haven't they done enough damage already? We talked it over, and we've decided to fly up to the main Umbrella HQ in Europe. I won't tell my sister about this trip because doing so could put her in danger. Please forgive me, Claire. We're gonna go shoot a bunch of corpos. Good job, Chris. I got the unicorn Leon. medal. It's good to see you're still among the living. It looks like we're not gonna find your brother here after all. You were in the wrong country. There's no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. Let's split up, look for any survivors, and get out of here. Right. One last thing. Here's a radio. Take it. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. Don't work too hard. Fognut says I can just take it. Okay. I trust him. 
That's five free shells. So the other shotgun was just an easy route to kill the uh, liquor. I'm okay at that. Marksman contest winner, Chris Redfield. Nothing useful. Free bullets. The owner is probably a member of the NRA. That must be Barry's desk because he's crazy. Picture of a young man, there's a good chance it's her boyfriend. That's Jill's desk. How dare you say that? <clears throat> okay, so here's the deal. If I check this desk 50 times, I get a picture of Becker's. And it's really funny because they've clearly, well, at least to me, it looks like they took the picture and they put it on top of a drawing. So, like, the angle's just slightly off and it kills me every time I see it. Not to mention, it's just kind of creepy that somebody, if you, <laughs> okay, think about it this way. Somewhere inside this desk, who I assume it's Wesker's, because somebody already searched the desk. Wesker just has like a picture of Rebecca. He's like, yes, yeah, <laughs> sure. But you got to check it 50 times. I don't know what the purpose of that is. Oh, there it is. Oh my God, I got the pervert film. Yay. It's stars. Look at them. Let's see, I recognize one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I recognize like eight of them, but I don't know what happened to the others. I can't believe what is happening to this city. Okay. Why don't you go play some Duke Nukem on that computer? I'll be back. Looks like a real photo. That was a good, it was some good art. It's Wesker's desk. Wesker's weird. Oh, somebody cleaned up all the zombies. That's nice. What who picks all the zombies? That must be Mr. X. It's locked. I need a spade key. Okay. We got the funny unicorn metal. We can just run on back. It's not even an issue. We can even skip the door transitions in this port, which makes it the best one. I like the door transitions. I'll let a few of them play out because it's, you know, part of the aesthetic, right? But like, imagine playing this for the very first time and seeing this exact stare <laughs> animation over and over. It would drive me crazy. Look, how's my inventory looking? By the way, Leon is fast. Oh yeah, okay, here. Yeah. We gotta we got look at the creepy film. Ha 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 ha. That stands for sick. Recruit. Look, look at her face. <laughs> it's like, it's a picture. I think either that or very good drawing of somebody in a basketball uniform, but just like, uh, I, I think that might be an actual photo of the actress from Resident Evil 1. So there's several alarming things is that I, I I think the basketball might actually be photoshopped in there. Uh, the head looks monstrous. And why does Wesker just have this picture in his desk? I think we're, I think we're getting to the end of a different, you know, side investigation. The Wesker, the Wesker stories, you know what this implies that Wesker had a picture of a lady with a basketball and cut out a picture of Rebecca's face and put it over it. So he's he's like in the he's in the the printing room where Leon is right now. He's got his exacto knife. He's cutting out Rebecca. He's like, yes. Where's that Sports Illustrated Raccoon City Edition? Anyways, all I'm saying is they need to release a Resident Evil basketball game. It'll be like Space Jam, except it's like stars versus umbrella on the court film d has been filed <laughs> oh god the implications uh well I, I think i'm fine really i mean i could get hurt but that's kind of the risk right Actual lore there. 
Wesker just wants to be Rebecca. He's like, I want to be Rebecca Chambers. Maybe that was a picture of Wesker sitting there. And he's like, put Rebecca's face over himself in a picture. He's like, yes. Oh, fuck. I mean, Buffalo Bill Wesker would be scared. Oh, the, the beef jerky got me. Get away, Leon. It pulled your little Chucky hair, your little doll hairs. Resident Jam. I like Resident Jam. Resident Evil player says Hellbent originally they were going to be zombies that were like crimson heads but looked more like liquors. It was going to be named Powered Up Zombie but it's cut for unknown reasons. Hmm. If it got cut for any reason, it's probably, uh, memory. If I had to take a guess. Like, they had the CD to draw from, right? But it was already split across two CDs. You can only load so much into each scene and have it actually remembered by the PS1, so it was probably an issue like, well, how many zombies you want on screen and how many, uh special variables do you want across the entire map they gotta be you know semi-permanent i bet it's something like that oh apollo this is the the 2009 pc port for japan only but also translated into english for me because i don't know japanese ray you know, it would be really fucked if that key didn't fall out. You know, if it just didn't jiggle right. That would that would suck. Check the key. It's the fucking shape of a spade. Did we see any spade doors, Leon? What does our map say, Leon? Our map says we missed a door or two, but, uh... Yeah, one was a diamond or something. I guess I could run back and take a peek, but let's just go the other way anyways. For fun. Sprow, sprow, you're under arrest. I show up to work and I just start pulling the trigger. I'm Leon Kennedy. Oh, that's one. up Leon <laughs> they're getting on you <laughs> the S stands for skittish oh my leg no Thank you, Insanity Blaze. I appreciate. Hey, freeze! You're under arrest. You're not dead. Now you're dead. Tactical reload. Okay, what was the what was the code again? Let's see. Two two three six.
I will take the shotgun shells. And on an ancient scroll, we found a police station map on a parchment made out of the skin of children and a green herb, which I could use. Cause I get hit. What else is laying around here? You got any cool stuff like ammo? Police usually have lots of ammunition laying around. Probably gonna regret picking that up, but I guess I could just eat the green herb anyways. I don't think there's any hidden items here. I think what you see is what you get, but you know, I gotta check. It's been a while, it's been long enough. <sighs> yeah, I should have seen that coming. Hey, fuck face. Oh, okay. He's actually dead. I guess. Got a heart. S is for sus. Leon sus Kennedy. Ooh. I believe it. Okay, well, I, I'm just using that herb, and then there's herbs out here for whatever. Fuck. I wasted my time. I wasted my time. Wasted my fucking time. Well, you know what? At least I killed everything. Taking home a consolation prize of one green herb. I did get the shotgun shells. Shotgun shells are good. And we can skip door transitions, so this really isn't the time sink it would normally be. It's such a big deal to be able to skip these fucking things. Yeah, let's just go back to the other chest. Put some shit up. Why not? That stands for, uh... Sorted? Leon sort sorted Kennedy? He's very good at sorting things. <laughs> Leon controls like a RC car Kennedy. I guess I could just pop a save now just to be safe. There's there's always time for safety. Leon, Leon, save Kennedy. Yes, yes, yes. He's sad. I understand. Okay. Well, I saw the unicorn puzzle. I found the hidden shotgun shells and I got the key. I just forget which one was the spade door. I think it's in here though. Or maybe it was past the star's office. Leon sex god Kennedy. I mean, doesn't appear so. <laughs> you don't get laid at all. Patrol port. We recovered a report of a suspicious individual skulking around the sewers of the outskirts of Raccoon City. I searched the area and located the individual, but he ran away before I was able to question him. I recovered the following items. A small amount of C4 plastic explosive. Electronic detonator. 19x9. <laughs> or 19 times 9 parabellum rounds. Infrared scope broken into report. Oh, fuck. What kind of cop would tell on a, a CIA agent? That's a good way to get like, hey, a crank. Leon, shove it, Kennedy. Hello, Christian.
Please don't touch me. Wait a minute. Okay, no, that's fine. The arms went away. They got bored. They're like, ah, oh, we're out of here. Diamond, okay, but past the star's door is probably good stuff. How's the inventory looking? Crank, I don't know if I need the crank right now. I mean, I'd assume I need it, but I'm not 100% sure that I do need it. I'm having to think for a second. That sucks, I hate thinking. If I'm gonna carry anything with me, I can't I can't be carrying literally everything with me. There's a lot of items in this game. I'm putting away the crank for now. I I don't believe I need it. And if I do need it, well I'll just run back. <laughs> we can skip doors, so it's not nearly as painful as it would usually be. And I bless the people who did the source board and the people who Americanized or English uh Adapted and upgraded the source port. They're good people. Good things are happening. Skip door. Hey, Rio. Good to see you. It's the last. Oh, a main entry. Oh, yeah. Shit. I do need it, but I think they throw another box. Of whatever. Claire's in there. She's doing good. Discard. Yeah, they gotta die. Uh. Ah. Okay, hold on. Hold on, zombies. I'm out. Time in. There we go. Ah, that'll help me save on some pistol bullets. Well, what's in here? We're not doing that yet. <laughs> I recognize it. I think that's progress. Yeah, cool. We despawn the zombies. Don't have to worry about any... Any, any of them biting my feet. Oh, my feet bitten. Hey, there we go. Okay, I can't get through there. It's fine. Looks like I was destined to go this way either way. Well, at least I got the pistol ammo. All right. I remember the solution to this one, but... Let's look around anyways, just in case I forgot something. Wait, what's over here? Oh. Yeah, I guess I should have taken the crank with me. Well, Leon, you did it again. Oh yeah, you can active reload in this one too. The other game you had to like empty out your magazine to reload it or do it in the menu. This one, you just reload. Oh my God. What's the solution to the puzzle, I wonder? push it to the right and I'll push this to the right oh my god I got the bishop plug which uh I forget when we use that but I'm pretty sure it's important We get the parts of the shotgun when it comes an ass kicker. Well, I assume so. Hey, Kubi Shacks, good to see ya. 
as he goes pass out on stream and the police were called that's awful you shouldn't be passing out on stream you know <laughs> it's not that important that's why they had to shut down that what was it playstation uh playroom i think it was the thing to where like everybody's playstation 4's web camera just like opened up a portal into their living room and you just saw like the worst society you had to put up with just chilling out with their ps4's and doing math and hitting their kids and all sorts of terrible fucking things they're like ah oh, shit we got to get rid of this to be fair they made the right move i would have gotten rid of that too it's good to see you thurman hope you're having a good week man I'm just playing video games. It's the only fun thing left to do on YouTube, I feel. <laughs> well, maybe not the only fun thing left to do, but you know what I mean. It's about YouTube for an hour. That's fun. I not heard that before. All right, so we got the small key, which we could use in that one room. We got Chief Secretary Diary. And we got Cuba Shacks with 10 bucks. Thank you, Cuba Shacks. They say one of my childhood PS1 classics. No matter how many times I keep played it, no matter how many times I've played it, I keep coming back. The soundtrack helps, I'll say that. If you got a computer, there's a damn good port if you're willing to put in a little work to get it compiled and working. Okay. <clears throat> Chief Secretary Diary A. I accidentally moved one of the stone statues on the second floor when I leaned against it. When the chief found out about it, he was furious. I swear the guy nearly bit my head off, screaming at me to never touch his statue again. If it's so important, then maybe he shouldn't have put it out in the open like that. I heard that all the art pieces from the chief's collection are rare items, literally worth hundreds of thousands of dollars. I don't know which is the bigger mystery. Where he finds those tanky things or where he's getting the money to pay for them. I wasn't surprised to see the chief come in today with yet another large picture frame in his hands. This time it was a really disturbing painting depicting a nude person being hanged. I was appalled by the expression on the chief's face as he learned that, or I'm sorry. I was appalled by the expression of the chief's face as he leered at that painting. Why would anyone consider something like that to be a work of art is beyond my comprehension. Chief Irons just didn't give a fuck. He's like, whatever, it's my naked torture painting. If you don't like it, fucking call the cops. <laughs> Except you can't. I am the cops. What are you going to do? Tattle on him? Tattle on the chief? That's a good idea. All right, let's let down the safety ladder. Let's get out of here. Resident Evil 2 story is really cheesy, but I love how even the game is like, okay, look, it, this 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 PlayStation's fucking stupid. It makes no sense. What do you mean I don't need to use it? I'll push the button. Okay, I guess I didn't need the crank, but you know what? This leads to better places anyways. I will go down the ladder. You got a PC port of the original three? Yeah, yeah, Cuba Shacks, the, uh... I forgot the company's name now, Source something. They do a good job. Well, I mean, at least it works. What was I doing again? I unlocked everything. Do I need, uh, I guess I'll go talk to old what's his face. I found the Yukon medal. Okay. I see where to go. How's inventory looking? Kind of bloated. But you know what? I'll keep the crank. It's fine. I will. All right. Handgun bullets. Check. Shotgun, check. The shotgun for the Remington M1-1000 series. Special shotgun shells for just one gun? What the fuck? All right.
Eh, I'll hold on to the crank, whatever. Who do I think is better for the Duke? Or who do I think is better, the Duke or the Merchant? Ah, I like the Duke. He serves a pretty strong story point. Merchant's fun, though. Yeah, we'll just go upstairs. There's, a few, there's another thing upstairs that I need to check. We can skip this transition, though. It's great. I can't express how great that is. I think that's part of the Resident Evil Rebirth mod. Those people do really good work, and it's free, too, so... That's also nice. You usually get charged for something like this. Wait a minute. Yeah, I guess there's that, but I can't get... Oh, okay, purple means I can't fucking do shit. Okay, I get the map now. I don't need to be here. Thurman says, Cubs, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this guy, we'll just say this guy. That makes it more fun, I suppose. This guy had a four drink limit, drank eight, ate the burger like animal that passed out <laughs> until the police woke him. <laughs> oh man. I wish, <laughs> I wish I could get a free wake up call every day like that. That's insane. <laughs> oh, that's, uh, that's something special. I hardly know what to say to that. <laughs> Freeze! Sprout, Sprout, you're under arrest. If you resist, I will be forced to shoot you, sir. Please, please don't make me do this. Handcuff him. Sir, you're under arrest. <laughs> Freeze. He's on fire, so he's probably double dead. Oh, no, he's not. Standing my ground. Starting September 1st, I won't even need a license to carry around a gun anymore. We can just walk like we're Resident Evil characters everywhere. It's going to be great. I'm just going to walk outside with like 18 pistols strapped to my legs and my arms and my forehead. <laughs> oh, hey, thank you, Insanity Blaze. I just like playing video games, man. I, I YouTube's, a, YouTube's a thing. It can be fun, but that's a fucking liquor. That's a fucking liquor. Okay, hey. If you're so tough. Oh, it's a fucking crow. Never mind. Die, bird. I can't imagine doing YouTube for much more than games, though. Simple. Also not like tragic, you know, worst thing that can happen when you're playing video games is that the game sucks or you say something embarrassing. That's about all the risk. It's pretty low risk. Kind of lame after a point though, but man, I'm not going to do backflips on video. If I could do backflips, I probably would though. It comes from a place of jealousy. That's a bunch of fucking birds. Yeah, leave me alone. Get out of here. I can't imagine theming a channel based on how much I could drink. I just, you know, that should be a bad idea in general. That's how much alcohol I could consume. Excessive pressure may walk, rupture the tank. Okay, well, we got a crank for that. I don't need to use this right now. Okay, well, we'll come back in a second to that. Cody Nickel with five bucks says, even though I don't work overnight anymore, I always stay up to watch you help. And much love and thanks for streaming. Well, thank you, Cody Nickel. I appreciate you, man. Hope you get good hours and they don't fuck with you too much at work. I'm pretty sure I can use the crank up there, but let's go see what's going on out here. There's a, there's a lady of the night. Freeze. Prostitution's illegal in Raccoon City, ma'am. Put your hands up. 
freeze. It's 8 p.m. It's past curfew. Where's your mask, sir? <laughs> pow, pow. I need to play Dead to Rights next. Anybody ever play Dead to Rights? It's great. So you're a cop, but you also got a dog who bites people. It's pretty good. I mean, most of the games kind of suck a little bit, but the premise is fun enough. You're faking, sir. You're, <laughs> I just uh, used up all my pistol ammo, but I feel good about it. Thurman says anything else and they shut you down anyways. Yeah, yeah. I really appreciate anybody who like makes uh non-streaming content now because they kind of discouraged everybody from doing that. It's like, well, you what you'll do is you'll put it up on the internet and you'll leave it in a box for a month and we'll decide through a computer algorithm if you said too many curse words. And then if you don't get the monetization, you can re-upload it until you it works. I don't know. That's a far cry from old days. Oh my god! Oh, that's what? Oh, oh my god. Oh, fuck. I'm scared. Get splattered. Leon Shotgun Kennedy. It's too dangerous to go back out. Bullshit, I just wasted those clowns. Okay, fine. It's fine. I got all the cranks. I got the bullets. And I even got some ink ribbons. And I'm gonna, I guess, use one? I mean, how far away am I really? Does it matter? You know what? This is probably a hint. It's like, hey, butthole. Guess who's gonna show up, maybe? I don't remember. It's been a long ass time. And I don't remember anything past this point. Let's see. Dante's Hell for Talking Devil May Cry. How about Dante's Inferno? Anybody remember that game? It kind of sucks, but the story's funny. Like, I can't, I can't say that the combat's good because you're just fighting the same dude over and over again, right? It's like God of War, but with like four enemy types. But... <clears throat> One character just has giant exposed tits that with babies crawling out of the nipples. It's it's fucked up. Well anyways. Gonna put this inferno out. I hope the pilot's all right. My God. Wait, I still got the... Can I put that away? I ain't afraid of no birds. As long as I'm fast, they can't do nothing. But I want to put away this... stuff that I didn't need because I'm stupid. I guess I didn't need to save it all. <laughs> that was pretty easy to get through. All right, well, I'll remember that. Come back if I fucking need it. I think we're good. No birds. Yeah, you know, you can really book it across the station. So what's what's going on over here? Helicopters are complete wreck. Oh yeah, I needed to actually go back there anyways though, right? I remember. Okay. Well, you know, at least I, I had good uh good hustle. Good hustle, Leon. 
Anybody remember the first video game system or first game? Pretty sure the first thing I played was Super Mario Brothers. That was okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, let's see. Silent Hill? I'd play some Silent Hill. Silent Hill's pretty good. But I like the guns in Resident Evil a whole lot, too. I think that the pilot will make it. He's just got to rest a little bit. He's tired. So what's in this door? What's so special? Oh, yeah. It's Chief Iron's mega porno jerk off fuck up room. Okay, well, chugging out for this one. Yeah, diamond key. We know where that goes already. An armored stone statue. The stand reads, Tyranos and the Brave revives with the two lights. Oh, the jewels. Ah! I gotta go get those gems. I need gemeralds. Precious gemeralds. But they're right here, so it's no big deal. Gems. He has one Silent Hill is one of your favorites or is your dad's favorite game. Yeah, it's a good one. Highly recommend it. Wait a minute. Wrong way. Oh, uh, skipping doors saves so much time. Like, it may not feel like it, but we've saved literal minutes so far. Like, just complete minutes. There's a hole about the size of a fist in this woman relief. Well, let's relieve that hole with a gym. She loves it. Spow. He really does look like a Chucky doll. You want to be my friend? I got the fucking king plug. Where are you going to shove that, Leon? King plug. I don't even think I need this right now. So I guess I'm just gonna run around with the diamond key and hope for the best. It's a fucking diamond key. Gotta go like downstairs or something. Hold on. Okay, yeah. Uh, I'm going the wrong way for one. I guess there's two ways I can go. But I think I want to knock out the one on the other side of the police station first. If I remember right. Which I probably don't, but... Fuck it. Here I go. Run, Leon. Look at him go.
Boy, this game sure sets and establishes its tone really well, huh? You think War of the Monsters would be awesome? I could do War of the Monsters. Oh, fuck. Leave me alone! Good job, Leon. You got cheap shot me with these guys, huh? Okay, well, they're not going to cooperate and move in a group, so they get the pistol. Beautiful film. Anything else? Nope, just a bunch of dead cops. I unlocked it. Well, that's good. Where am I, though? Okay, that just leads out to the other side. Which is nice. That's a good shortcut, but we don't have to take shortcut right away. Okay, so that opens up a shortcut there. It's good we had that. And we got film we can look at. Which I'm eager to see. Char, be having a bad day? <clears throat> ah, she's working, man. You know how work is. Work is exhausting. Also, she's enjoying Silent Hill 2 right now. Like a whole lot. She really loves some Silent Hill 2. <laughs> she got the water ending, if you know that one. She she actually cried. She's like, ooh, ooh. It's pretty funny. Bill May. Look, it's a G Birkin monster arm thing. OG human body experiment. Bill May's been filed. I got the evidence. It's cool I went back there though to, to have the extra health to kind of sit in there is a good thing. And taking some hits here and there. And what am I doing next? Another diamond door, which gonna have a fight, but I probably won't need much more than I got to get through that. Must need the crank handle, but whatever. We'll find out. We got a shortcut. Oh, Spirit Taker, I'm sure Sharpie will like the first Silent Hill. The first Silent Hill is kind of hard to hate. Unless you hate the Spanish guitar, in which case, uh,. Bad news for you. On Silent Hill 1, you're going to be hearing a lot of that. Oh, yeah, this is a whole area. Well, let's not pick up the herb yet. I did it. No, no, no. This is... Hey. I snuck in. <laughs> what? What'd you call me? Oh, my God. Look at his teeth. He's got, he's got the chompies. He's got, he's got rabies, freeze. I don't know what to call it. I wouldn't be a good guy to pick the name of the zombie virus. I'd probably call it like the jiggles or something like that. Hell yeah. I got more keys than a fucking Casio. Man, I don't think you killed him, Leon. I think to leave him just kind of half dead like that's morally fucked. You got extra bullets, but sure, you know, whatever. I wonder if he had anything on him. Let's let's loot his body while it's jiggling. Leon's just unfazed. He's like, yeah, I joined the police force to shoot people. That's the... Why, why else would you join? Spow, spow, bang. Hell yeah. So, memo to Leon. To Leon S. Kennedy, congratulations on your assignment to the Raccoon City Police Department. We all look forward having you as part of our team and promise to take good care of you welcome aboard from all the guys of the rpd 
the Moodle Leon has been filed. Oh, that's nice. Did you guys leave me any bullets to help me shoot? Must be nothing. They got me some soda pop. That's not, hey, I can steal my coworkers' bullets though. Tom, can I borrow some bullets from your desk? <laughs> I hear it's gonna be rough out there tonight. <laughs> all right, all right. Someone has made quite a mess here. Someone has made quite a mess. Quite a mess. What's going on? Nothing. Man, they got him a a Coca Cola and a Sprite and like. It looks like just some champagne. He's going to... Oh, and a funny set of Ma Groucho Marx glasses. Look. he get the cigar and go, ah, and then everybody fucking laugh. They brought enough sodas for everybody. They were going to put on the two hats, drink some sodas, and put on the Groucho Marx mask. How's it going to be a real lame party? All right. What's over here? I unlocked it. I already checked Westerger's desk and we saw the, the disgusting photo. Okay, that's clear. The only other way we have to go is a stupid way. I should just go ahead and grab that herb then, huh? Did I grab that herb? I would like to start stacking health in my desk. Desk in my, uh, pff, chest. Yeah. I sure there's nothing else here. Oh, Lugu's body disappeared. He's he's up again and he's out for revenge. Yeah, I didn't miss anything. Wham! Okay, so we need to be on the first floor, but there's a chest right here. Now we got a little bit of health building up. I think we'll lose the diamond key, and I'm pretty sure we need the heart key, but I'm not 100% on that, but we'll find out. It's in the shape of a fucking heart. Hell yeah. Scum. I'm doing on bullets. Eh, okay. Could be worse. You should have you should have reined in your man. Uh, fucking druggies ever since they made heroin legal. This town's gone to shit. Combine with that. I'm gonna get bit, aren't I? Right around the corner. Nope, okay, I'm good. Okay, and this room's free. Well, I still wanna kill these zombies, because I hate them. Also, I got a feeling I've, sh yeah, since I've shot every single one of them, if I leave and come back, they're just going to get a free refill, aren't they? Should have brought my knife. Why'd I leave my combat knife? Oh, well. Can I unlock this? What is this? Hell yeah, discard. We'll take the small key. It's a magic mirror. What the fuck's a magic mirror? <laughs> Nothing special. Well, it's magic. Well, 
club. I need the, the club key. I'll take these herbs as a prize. They better all be dead. Okay, they're dead. I'm happy. I take no responsibility for what the state of Texas does. These are crazy times. I lie myself with no one. Oh yeah, fucking mix the herbs up. Where else am I going? It's somewhere else, right? I think it's that, but I'm not 100% sure. Oh, I think I actually just missed a room that I was supposed to go in. My bad. I was supposed to go in the magic room, I suppose. The camera angles do get to me after a while. Making decent progress, though, for not remembering too much. Is that a door? No. There we go. Wait, hold on. I definitely went in there, though. I, I guess I didn't get all the items. Or this is the... No, this is just the correct side. Okay. I'm a fucking idiot. What do we got in here? Yeah, I'll take the cord. First aid spray. Damn. Well, they went and stuffed my inventory. That's not fair. Fine. You may have done that, and I may have to run all the way back, but I can skip the door transition, so... It won't even take that long. I want those healing items. I'm going to get hit. There's going to get there's going to be a point to where I slip up really bad and I'm going to be like, "Damn. I sure wish I didn't leave that healing spray there cuz I don't know what's going to happen in this wacky game." And then I'll suffer. The cord can go up. That probably need the heart key. I don't know. But this is better than what we had before. Ever thought of rigging one of those virtual webcams with my persona for a live stream? Eh. I get that people like it, but it's a lot of extra work. I just play video games. It's simple, you know. Not to mention with what they put the uh, Planet Dolan characters through, you really don't want to in any way identify as one of those characters. <laughs> Hard pass on that too. Uh, yeah, yeah, I almost forgot the health spray. I say people can enjoy cartoon characters in whatever wacky way they want, but... Hey! You cheesy son of a bitch. Well, he wasn't too tough. I'm still not going to use that if I don't have to. I got green herbs. What's in here? Oh, yeah. It's locked. Run, Leon. We have to go get that cable and fix the shutter thing, I think, or, or something. We got to do something. trying to remember what I need wires for, but I got most of the plugs and a crank that I hadn't even used. I haven't saved in a while. I think I'll... Well, we can get to a better place to save.
fine. Doing fine. Man, rabies is awful. That's that's gotta be the worst way to die. If there's anything you'd want to wipe out, I think rabies would be on the list. Wait a second, what do I need for this? Okay, I need to get the cord. Just double checking. Duh, you're missing a cable. Gotta go to Lowe's. See if they have it. No smoking. Well, now you can smoke anywhere. See, that's that's why the apocalypse is going to be so good to certain types. Why'd I grab that? <laughs> You'll be like, well, I can smoke anywhere I want when the world's going to die. And you know what? They're right. When you're right, you're right. Leon Safety Kennedy. You know times are good when they have riot shields for <laughs> in the police station. You know, just in case something happens. Okay, this hall is red. So, what's the deal? And yeah, nothing special, that's what I thought. Okay, I, s I think I see. I get up the third floor. Okay, yeah. yeah. We could pop a save around that corner. Okay, this is fine. This is kind of the right way. I mean, it could have been done way faster, but well, it's me playing, so they don't have shutters on these windows. Just the <laughs> just the other wing, so doesn't make a whole lot of sense. But that's fine. Do, 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 do. No, I mean the knife wouldn't be a bad idea, but I don't think it's necessary to have it. I think it was intended to be a fail safe, but you could use it to save some bullets, I guess. I think it might be better an outbreak or not outbreak. I'm sorry. Uh, Nemesis. I don't know. The knife's fine. You can beat the game with it. It's great. But if I don't have to use it, I don't bother. It's really good in RE4. And I'm like out of pistol ammo though, but plenty of shotgun ammo. There's a few of those crowds of zombies I could have splattered with a shotgun and saved a lot of handgun ammo with. But think, they've given us over a hundred bullets already. Who's my favorite playable Resident Evil protagonist? Asked Jericho Jim. Uh, psh. Joe Baker. Cause he just punches them all and he eats centipedes. <clears throat> When Joe Baker gets bitten by a gator, he just eats a fucking centipede and he's better. How can you not love that? Oh yeah, if I had my tiny key, I could open that up well. Yeah, I kind of fucked up, but let's check the stairwell anyways. Let's make sure I'm supposed to be here. Pretty sure this is it. Yeah, so I need the crank handle, a small key. And uh, that's about it. 
I can check it out anyways, though. If there's any items up here, I can just go ahead and pick them up for the ride back. Doesn't look like it. Okay, they kind of figured you'd fuck it up. Okay. Well, I got one on me again, year after year. Barry Burton, you like Barry Burton? Barry Burton's not too bad. Although he's kind of a bitch in the first game. <laughs> Jill just like judo kicks him and takes his gun away and you can keep it and he'll just die. Our family. Well, thank you, Brilliant. I appreciate you. I'm playing Resident Evil the second. And I forgot everything I just said about what I was doing, but I remember what I need to do. That's what's important. He does control like a little tank. Oh, I'd say more like an RC car than a tank. Man, so much time saved by skipping doors. I've been counted up a little bit in my head. I'm like, man, we'd be here forever. So we need the crank. Uh, I don't need the small key, but I'm going to use it anyways. I guess we don't need the heart key. Keep lugging that around for no reason, but my inventory's looking pretty open. They weren't too bad on you. Get out of there, Leon. Keep moving. Why would you book people on the second floor next to your, like, special operations unit? It's weird. I mean, I assume that's what the bench is and the waiting rooms and all that are for. I don't know. What's in here? Yes. Bun. Reloaded handgun. Oh, yeah. Manual fire. We have tactically reloaded. Okay, that's, that's kind of smart, but I'm not taking credit for that because I didn't know that was in there. Where's Mr. X? He'll show up. I think I forget he may be a B scenario thing it's been a it's been more than a minute since I played this game I don't know if you can tell but it's kind of old but it still looks great yeah B scenario only yeah, that's why I figured I won't be seeing Mr. X I was kind of half prepared for him but that was stupid of me seems broken won't work could I perhaps need to use a crank it's a square hole I got a square crank. Yeah, wait, what the fuck? What's going on here? I'll push the switch. Oh, we're missing a crank. Somebody wrote something here. But Leon's not going to read that. That'd be a waste of his time. The iron plate seems to have been recently moved. What do you mean, Leon? No, I won't push it because I need the other gear. making sure i'm not missing anything like i said it's been a while i still got the crank okay the crank's just gone so that solves that problem let's leave 
I guess I'll just run this way for now. Because I don't remember where the gear is at all. That, that is beyond me. Oh, fuck yeah. Red herb. I didn't even see it. I guess I'm glad I came back here. Where does this lead? Second floor of the main hall. All right. Run, Leon. Move your little legs. We got to find a gear or a cog, whatever they want to call it. I don't care. It just has to fit. Wait a minute. I think there were, there's maybe an item here that I just completely mulled over. Nah, I got magazines. I think this is the shortest way to where I want to be. I just got to dodge the crows. There's no big deal. I guess I could grab some herbs. There'll be a point to where I'll be glad I did that and I wanted to go back to another point. This must be it. Yay! Yay! I am a problem solver of the highest caliber. We'll grab that other green herb later. What's going on here? Oh shit, well. I mean, I'll probably be glad I use the shutter elsewhere, right? Shit. Shit. So I could have used that cable on either or. I used it on the one. It's probably least important. dogs bad dog Leon dog shooter Kennedy He loved every second of that. He's he's wondering if there are more dogs. Perhaps there are more dogs that I could play with. Back to it, Leon. Hurry before they suspect. Well, I'm out of pistol ammo. So what now? Video game, you're gonna give me a map? I'll take the map. That's cool. 
power can be rerouted to areas with insufficient power using these five switches using all the power may cause a short and cut the power supply there's a switch no Oh wait, I can solve this. This is a stupid puzzle for dumbasses. I got this. Up. Up. Oh my god, it's almost overloaded. I think I'll move it down. I think I'll move it down again. And then I think the last one will be up. Oh fuck, I'm a genius. Did it take a message? Yeah, he's got some green herbs laying there. What does the map say? Nothing about where, which one may potentially be a save room, but I'd like to find a save room really badly. That would be great. That's arm storage. That's definitely not a safe room. You probably don't even have one down here. Probably just a false hope of mine. Autopsy room. There, well, damn it. Well, you're just gonna have to deal with the autopsy room for a minute. They gotta use the restroom, but I'll leave Leon here. We'll, we'll keep it spooky. Maybe a monster will come out of nowhere and kill Leon while I'm away and I'll feel like a dumbass, but I don't think it'll happen. I'll be right back. Oh, I just about drowned. I don't know how I'll ever survive this evil residence. Good night, little munch. All right. I'm back. Let's uncover the mysteries of the fucking downstairs place. Okay, that's the parking garage. We know what's over there. I remember that. Okay, I get it.
These kids still remember a lot of this fuck nut. I remember a pretty good amount of it. But clearly not enough. Well, I'm out of pistol ammo, but the dogs are dead. Hey, sure, I'll go down. Into the sewers. Yeah, pain's not bad. But, like, some pain sucks. Like, you know, when your body just gets old and your body's like, I hurt because I'm old. It's like, I get it. How many more signs does one need? At least, I don't, I don't think grandma needs Alzheimer's. She's like, oh, my Alzheimer's lets me know that my brain's broken. I don't know. I say get rid of pain for people and then watch as they, like, chew their own fingers off. <laughs> or clip off their fingers with their fingernail clippers. Like, I don't know. I just started clipping and it just felt right that I have, like, shorter fingers, you know? Like, shorter. More compact. So I made my fingers short. That's good. You gotta. You know what? I'll save. I'll. I'll I'm kind of being a baby with the saves. I think I could have used way less of these, but whatever. I got the. I got the saves. They're not too stingy with the ink ribbons. How do you treat hemorrhoids, as Black Mabana? I hear they use a laser. They like fucking Star Wars. Those fuckers. Like. Psh Oh, okay, we can go up them like this is a little too small for an adult to enter. That's a weird thought, Chris. It's just the right size for a child. You treat hemorrhoids with respect, that's true. makes the best movie soundtracks this is a joke what is the answer <laughs> gotta go find the key now <laughs> hey Later six crazy cats. Or later cats in the wall, I'm sorry. Sorry about that. Oh hey Ada. When I saw the uniform, I thought you were another zombie. Who are you? Ada Wong. And what are you doing here? I'm looking for some guy named Ben. He's one of those reporter types, always looking for a scoop. I heard he was locked up in the cell block, only there's a wrecked car barring the entrance. I've been trying to find another way inside. If we work together, we can move this thing. Give me a hand here, will you? Okay, I guess I have to, because I'm Leon. You know what, hold on. I'll give you a hand once I'm done playing around over here. Okay, I guess I'll help. Scoot. Hey, 
In medieval times, they got rid of hemorrhoids with a big, like, white hot iron rod they shove up your rectum. That's why I damn near killed him. Well, what's the deal, Ada? Where are we going, Ada? I could have sworn I saw a shiny thing here. I swear the keys are around here. But I guess it doesn't matter. Ada, wait! Robbie, the way you get people to watch is to just keep making videos. And if you have fun, maybe they'll do good, maybe they won't. But the most important thing is to not be a shill or a sleaze. Man, I wish I had more handgun ammo. I use it all up, though. I ain't afraid of you. They didn't even give me doggy treats. No wonder they're all rambunctious and angry. Good thing we live in the one region with the mega healing herb, or else this whole survival thing would have been impossible. Hey, blue herb. How do I feel about the spider? Sorry, I didn't get to your question, Resident Evil. Um, the cut spiders, I kind of understand because they're goofy as fuck. I do like the giant spiders, though. Hey, bullets. Oh yeah, Burble, drag him. Let me guess, you must be Ben, right? Get up, now. What do you want? I'm trying to sleep here. Is this the guy? Ben? You told the city officials that you knew something about what's been going on, didn't you? What did you tell them? And who the heck are you? I'm trying to find my boyfriend. His name's John. He was working for a branch office of Umbrella, based in Chicago, but he suddenly disappeared six months ago. I heard a rumor that he's here in the city. I don't know anything. And even if I did, why would I want to tell you? Okay, I say we leave him in there. Does anyone know where they put the key to this cell? I have it right here, officer. But I'm not about to leave this cell. Those zombies aren't the only things crawling around out there. What was that? Like I said, I'm not leaving this cell. Get out of here before you lead it right to me. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. I'm the only cop left alive in this building. What? Look, if you want to live, then you're going to have to leave with me. But do you even know how to get out of the city? There's a kennel in the back of the building. Inside the kennel is a manhole. Go through and it'll lead you to the sewer entrance, but it won't be easy. All right, I'm going. Bye.
Parasite Eve. Oh, maybe we could do Parasite Eve, Blackman Bane. At least the first one, maybe not the second one. Manhole opener. But Shrook is not even here. There's a kennel in the back of the building. Inside the kennel is a manhole. Go through and it'll lead you to the sewer entrance, but it won't be easy. Freeze. Well, I mean, it's right here. It's not that far away. A tool to open the manhole. Use. Uh. Oh, gross. And the manhole, Leon. Huh? It's a fucking spider. Hello, spider. Piece of shit. Sleep can be a pain. I feel. Well, we killed the spiders. We got a couple of poison heals here. And plenty of regular health. my mind I just like organizing this stuff make it look nice yeah, I'll do oh, I didn't even notice any grim in there okay yeah, yeah save King Rookie, King Rook Bishop Knight. I think I'm one plug short, so. I have to come back later. I got four out of five. Oh, hey, Ada. Ada? I don't think I've introduced myself yet. My name's Leon. I'm with the RPD. It's a dead end. There's a big hole. You think we can get upstairs through this shaft? 
Give me a boost. I'll go and check. Good night, Joaquin. There she goes. I'm Ada now. Look at my inventory. Picture taken fairly recently of Ada and some dude. Look out. I weigh like 80 pounds. Zoom. Do I bring this to Leon? I guess I do. Hold on. Does anybody remember? Does Ada like get to keep stuff that I would like to leave for Leon? Does she just steal these shotgun shells? I doubt it. But I forget how long the Ada segment is. Hmm. You know what? I'm just going to take him anyways. That'd be a weird thing to do to the player. I forget. Okay, but if I go upstairs, which direction do I gotta go? That's the main thing. Oh, I'm not gonna get a lead on that. Okay, well, let's go up and run away. Goodbye, dog. Sewage map is good. Got a sewage map. Oh my god. It's the crate puzzle from Resident Evil 1, but it's reverso. This is the police water room for when you need to drown people. The special police sewer. Wait a minute. <laughs> Almost did this the dumb way. Although. I mean, I guess every way is the dumb way. Yeah. I don't I remember can I pull these oh you can jump yeah okay that's what I forgot Great. She's a special agent. She was trained for this. Not everybody can solve puzzles like these. Hello, Sandwich Master. Get you a drink. And she's pretty strong to push boxes that big. Oh my god. Oh yeah, I'm fetching stuff for Leon. I like RE2 Ada right now because RE2 Remake Ada had that dumb little electronic gizmo thing. I didn't like that too much. Hey, dog.
Leon, can you hear me? Ada, did you find anything? Right here. Ow, Think my fast. eye! Here's one more. Ow, my other eye! Hey, I can't reach the ventilation hole. I'm going to have to find another way around. I'll catch up with you later. What? Ada, wait! Oh, you got turned down again, Leon. Your life sucks, huh? Gonna make a blog about the Chads and the Stacys after that one. Yeah, all right. Gather, yeah, Leon. We gotta go back to the police station, kind of, I think. Wait, downstairs, maybe? Sorry for the five bucks is giving the most expensive thing on the menu, top shelf, please. You know what? For the bar, it's usually Johnny Walker Blue. That's ridiculously overpriced for what it is. Like, you know, it's still bourbon at the end of the day, right? My favorite is when people who don't like bourbon drink bourbon because it's expensive and they're like, oh, <laughs> you can tell on their face, like, oh, I fucking hate this, but I'm told it's great. I would uh, pour aside for a simple Jack and Coke. You know, I don't like Jack Daniels too much by itself, but I'll drink a Jack and Coke. It's not that bad. Or at least I can have one of those and not, like, regret it. I'm falling to a deadly loop of uh, Jack and Coke. The point to where I'm sick. Thurman <laughs> says Cobes. Oh no. Yeah. Thur Thurman, I think Cobes would drink bourbon and be like, mm, it's great. <laughs> Like old man liquor, dude. Sorry for two bucks. Thank you again, Cypher. He says, there's something under the sink will do fine. Well, we got plenty of stuff under the sink. There's some green stuff. And it looks like it's apple scented. I bet it's delicious. You just mix that in together with some like maple syrup. You got yourself a a fine drink. Where are you going? I got a key. I still didn't get into the ammo depository. Where's that key at? Bacardi, yeah, rum's fine. You know, as long as you, as long as you like it, because most liquor tastes like shit anyways, right? So you may as well get the one that has like the least appalling aftertaste, which bourbon, bourbon's got kind of that like old boot taste, like. Oh. Yeah, this guy had a big shot of Jack and starts to salivate profusely, trying to not to vomit. Oh, that's sad when they're like drooling like this. I got to spit. If I swallow my spit, I'll puke. <laughs> that's terrible. All right, well, I don't got the card for that. I'll get that later. Oh, shit, it's a liquor. Man, I chose the right time to look at the map. Oh yeah, we can't go in there. <laughs> and over there is kind of pointless right now, so... It means you didn't hydrate. It also means you probably didn't eat right. Like eating, eating like very poorly and then drinking a whole lot is a double 
whammy for your body. You really don't want to like, for example, eat a whole plate of brownies and start drinking Jack Daniels. That's a bad idea. Hey, card key, I need that. And I'm the fuck out of here. Oh, he got me. Oh, fuck. You guys aren't with the bullets. Celery is key. I, I mean, I don't mind like roasted. I mean, any kind of peanuts are fine. You could also try having fish for lunch, something high in protein. You'll be fine, really. You start the night with a Bloody Mary. Yeah, if you're drinking like vodka type drinks and you start with a Bloody Mary, that's not bad. Another big mistake people make is just like going, okay, it's time to drink. So where's the 16 ounce cup full of liquor? Let me just drink it all immediately and then the fun times will continue for a long time. Nah, just like you're putting too much shit in your system at once. You got to sip on it, man. Or, you know, get it. Or at least if you're going to pound a drink down, at least should be something that, you know, isn't going to be your entire night. Or your rule of thumb is to stay under $5 and you probably won't like be ill. Well, shit. I forget if I want to equip this or not. If I leave this, can't Ola uh, Claire have them both? I know this is important. Hmm. Claire gets the grenade launcher. So I think I'd rather take the machine gun as Leon. If Claire gets less you know inventory than let me look that up real quick give me a second i'm not making a stupid decision here i want to know what i'm doing probably just gonna take the submachine gun Yeah, grenade launcher. See, I kind of just want to leave that for Claire too, but I guess uh, Leon needs something, huh? All right, machine gun makes sense. Let's take it. I mean, Leon gets a pretty good pistol, though. I mean, leaving them both for Claire would be nice, right? But... It's nice that Leon has a machine gun. Ho, ho, ho. That's fine. I don't think it's too necessary to have it. But where am I going now? I got the... Spade key, I need a gear for the clock. And there's two areas on the first floor I haven't been through, so I need to make my way back upstairs. Okay, that's simple enough. This way. We'll heal up Leon in a bit, he's fine. for more than we gold well you know sorry leon we don't have prime reading material for you here nothing useful there's snacks there you know and nudie nudie pictures you know how much those nudie pictures will be worth during the apocalypse probably a lot because everybody's gonna smell bad and cool 
Aww. <laughs> Night Watchman's Diary. <clears throat> I finally had the chance to see the blue skies for the first time in ages, but it did little to lift my spirits. I was reprimanded by my chief for neglecting my duties while I was up on the clock tower. There's only one thing I still don't understand. The chief seemed to be more concerned about the fact that I was up on the tower rather than that I was neglecting my duties. Why was access to the tower prohibited in the first place anyway? Recently talked to the old man who works in the scrapyard out back. His name is Thomas. He's a quiet man and really seems to enjoy chess. He even went as far as to design a special key and lock engraved with the chess pieces on them uh, from one of the doors in the disposal yard. Yada, yada, yada. Tell me about the keys. We made plans to play chess tomorrow night. I can't help but to wonder how good he is. One thing's one thing that's been but that lost of bothers this guy. One thing that's been bothering me about him is the way that he's always scratching himself. Does he have some sort of issue with his skin, or is he just rude? Rude, stop scratching yourself. That is kind of rude. Thomas was a much better player than I had imagined. I used to think of myself as a fairly decent player of chess, but he did a pretty good job of humbling me. About the only thing I imagined that could match his skills in chess is his appetite. All the guy did was just talk about food throughout the entire game. He sounded fairly healthy, and, but he didn't look quite right. I wonder if he's okay. I was supposed to play another game of chess with Thomas, but we had to cancel because he hasn't been feeling too well. He stopped by to see me, but I told him to go back and rest since he was since he literally looked like the walking dead. He insisted that he was just fine, but I could tell he was really having problems. Come to think of it, I haven't felt too good myself lately. Then he died. Getting that gun. Oh yeah. I'm glad I double checked over here. Damn, we got a lot of bullets. I'm sure the game will take him away from us pretty easy. Hey, thank you, Jack. Maybe we'll do Portal 2 again someday soon. I guess we're just going to leave that. Yeah, let's just run to a chest. Probably nothing in my way, right? This popsicle sounds like a standard American meal to me. I think popsicle dinner is an American tradition, right? The American diet consists of hamburger, popsicles, Gatorade, and Pop-Tarts. Purple Drink says Rick and Morty turns them off because the science ain't right half most of the time and the fan base ruins it. I understand that. I think when they say, like, really, really profane curse words, though, it's a good time. It's the swear words that make me happy. Maybe I should save the machine gun. Hell, I don't even know where I'm going, really. Well, there ain't too many places this key could work. I didn't bring any health with me, so... Let 
No, let's just bring a green herb. This, this is the old trick that I do, because I always have way more green herbs than I need. If I just bring a green herb, I won't be disappointed if I got to eat it or throw it away. Don't forget the soda in between meals. Yeah, soda, if not Gatorade. Gatorade if they're, you know, watching their weight. I gotta watch my figures, so I drink sports drink with my loaded baked potato, baked Lay's potato chips. The chips are baked. It makes them less unhealthy because the diarrhea oil isn't there. Is there a green herb over here too that I missed? Well, it says I'm missing an item here, I think. At least that's what I think the red means, right? So where, where is it? Spit it out, pay up. Okay, or don't. It's fine. That's where I need to go anyways. Let's go. Run, Leon. Check the boxes. Nothing. Hey, six crazy cats. I've already done village. Village is good. Useless key. I will take the film. Oh, here's the, here's what I was talking about with the healing and all. fire but i gotta turn faucets i ain't ready for that yet light the queen the king and the jack and then the carriage will start running king queen jack okay say king queen jack right oh queen king the jack okay 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 oh i'm a genius Missing anything? I'm pretty sure I got everything. Let's get out of here. Okay, what's the easiest way to get to that attic? Okay, it's just straightforward then. We can use the, uh, yeah, the thing, you'll see, the ladder. You know, before we go there though, let's go get the film developed. Let's develop some film. Safe way to, eh, you know what? I don't care if it's safe or not. I'm fine. What could go wrong? I shuttered the windows. It should be safe. Hey, 
that's cool you got a rare pokemon card are those actually still worth a lot of money it might be more like financially reasonable to buy booster packs for card games and to like go to the lottery like instead of scratch offs you can just look for the fucking pikachu or whatever oh yeah film Film B. That's just a dead body pictured in front of the Acurus trailer or Taylor. Uh, I am pictured, pictured in front of Aruka's Taylor regressed into a zombie within two hours. Subject repeatedly complained about severe agitation of the epidermis. In addition to feelings of nausea, this happened up to the most uh or up to the moment he lost consciousness picture by r limber don't be i got evidence of zombies zombies are real everybody's gonna believe me hmm I don't know. Pouch would have been handy, but I feel like I'm overpowered as it is. Let's just run. As true says crazy cat, you can do everything right and still die younger than somebody who smokes meth out of their asshole. But you know, if you worry about it, that doesn't change anything, so why bother worrying? I'm gonna die, oh no. Think of all your favorite musicians and how you outlive them. Zoom, get out of here, Leon. We gotta go solve the clock tower puzzle. Leon's just having a good time. This is like Chuck E. Cheese to him. He's like on Legends of the fucking Hidden Temple. Hey, it's a liquor. I don't have to fight you. <laughs> Except that I should have because I just went the wrong fucking way. Oh well. We just did a whole tour of the uh, of west wing of the, or I'm sorry, the east wing of the whole precinct, just to avoid one little liquor. Oh yeah, if you get tired from not eating, that means you need to eat double food, burble drink. Every time I bite into a cheeseburger, my brain just explodes with happy chemical. smart that stupid liquor
There he goes. <laughs> all right, all right. Uh oh. Well, that's not even close to where I'm at. It's a cog. It wasn't a gear after all, it was a cog. I will push the switch. Yeah, fuck the police chief. First day I'm already disobeying orders. I will jump down the dirty old dust chute. Here I go. Goodbye, hell of a. No! No! Get away! No! No! You're gonna be a daddy. <laughs> that eyeball is just checking to make sure nobody saw him. I'm scared. Where am I? Okay, I can just back the fuck up and run away, but let's run this way and take a look. What happened? Oh my god. Ben! Can you still hear me? Come on, answer! Damn. I don't believe this. I almost got the story. <coughs> ben. Uh <laughs> Bitter irony. The chief of police, a co-conspirator. Oh, get that scum. Make him pay. Hang in there, Ben. Oh, my chest. It's burning. What's wrong? Whoa! Oh, I thought it opened the door. God, what was that? Desire for what two bucks says get pregnant. Well, he did. Copy of mail to the chief. Oh, thank you again, Cypher, by the way. <clears throat> To Mr. Brian Items, chief or Brian Irons, chief of the Raccoon City Police Department. We have lost the mansion lab facility due to the actions of the renegade operative Cypher. <laughs> there it goes. It took its time. Anyways, thanks again, Cypher. We have lost the mansion lab facility due to the uh, <laughs> due to the actions of the renegade operative Albert Wesker. Fortunately, his interference will have no lasting effects upon our continued virus research. Our only present concern is the presence of the remaining STARS members, Redfield, Valentine, Burton, Chambers, and Vickers. If it comes to light that the STARS have any evidence as to the activities of our research, dispose of them in such a manner that would appear to be purely accidental. Continue- Ah! Continue to monitor their progress and make certain their knowledge does not go public. And that will continue to be your contact throughout this affair. William Birkin. To Brian, blah, 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 chief. I've deposited the amount of 10,000 US dollars to the account of your, to the account for your services. This term as per our agreement. The development of the G virus scheduled to replace a T virus is near completion. Once completed, I am certain that I will be appointed to be a member of the executive board for Umbrella Incorporated. It is imperative that we proceed with extreme caution. 
Redfield and the remaining STARS members are still attempting to uncover information to, on the project, continue to monitor their situation, or continue to monitor activities and block all attempts to investigate the underground research facilities. William Birkin, two irons again. We have a problem. I have received information informing me that Umbrella HQ has sent spies to recover my research on the G-Virus. There are an unknown number of agents involved. They must not be allowed to take this project away from me as it represents my entire life's work. Search the facility or search the city thoroughly for any suspicious persons. Detain any such individuals by whatever means deemed or whatever means deemed necessary and contact me immediately through a net. With these precautions, any possible threat should be eliminated. I will not allow anyone to steal my work on the G-Virus. Not even Umbrella. William Birkin. Why would you write that down? That's just your own inner thought, unless you're just really up Byron's ass. Mail to the Chief. Where are you going, Ada? To the chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. Ada! Wait! Hey! Hey! Bro! Do you read me, Claire? We now have access to the back of the parking lot. Got it. I'm getting out of here and heading to the sewer. Can you meet me there? I'm on my way. Okay. Leon said he's taking the sewer, so I guess that means I gotta take the sewer. Oh yeah, tofu has like no flavor. Tofu's not too bad, it's the... I mean, they can be all right anyways. Found it to be inoffensive. The only thing I, there's like certain vegetables I can't stand, but you know, that's just personal taste. I don't do tomatoes. I don't like them. They're too gooey. They got like a, a goo to them. Not a big fan of gooey shit. Okay, so I got all the plugs that one thing but i'm trying to remember where oh yeah yeah that was in the sewer okay so i'm gonna have to put the pistol up or something fair enough wait aren't there five plugs i need though i think i need five plugs it's not uh Jump the gun here too hard. Oops. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Resident Evil says this game is going to have zombies that would be able to slowly transform into half a tyrant zombie creature is going to be called the Tyrant Inferior. That would have been interesting. I would have liked it. sure what to bring with me so i'll travel a little light if i bring the red herb they'll probably give me a first aid spray when i really want a green herb to go with it i got enough full health though it's three full healths four and a spray should be fine well i hate to use any of these other weapons on zombies i don't know I'm pretty sure we're gonna go fight 
a big spooky monster though. Well, either way, I think I need to grab the plugs actually. This is in case I'm wrong, let's go check that out first. So I don't like agonize over and then come back and go, oh, that's why she's at the sewer. It's right there, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Purple drink, I have no idea how Mag is larger than a shotgun. The entire point is that it's compact. I went the wrong way. <laughs> Leon, how, how could you have done that, you fool? Yo, again, being able to skip the transitions, great addition. I need to go to that weird Birkin area. Septic pot, I think, is the right way. Pretty sure I need five plugs, but okay, no, we're good. Oh my god. The goobler's growing. He's got a little funny face. Well, that's cool. Sure glad I brought the plugs with me. plenty left hey little bug guy get out of here okay that thing ain't quite dying i'm gonna fool around with this king rook bishop knight okay what do what do our files say about that was mentioned chess but it didn't really uh give me any answers No, no. All right, well, I guess we'll just have to guess for now. Oh, actually, no, I won't. I can just use these. I'm stupid. I thought I'd do them in a certain order. I got I got it confused. That's how they did it in the remake, but this is why I just plunk them in there. Okay. I did it! Hooray! You just take him in, Cypher. Ada!
What was that all about? Running off like that was reckless and stupid. Those zombies are everywhere. Not to mention that thing that got Ben. I was there, Leon. I know. Look, Ada. As an officer, it's my job to look out for you. But we're not going to get through this alive if we don't work together. Okay? All right. We'll do this your way, for now. I'm the man. You listen to me. I'm Leon. I'm big boy. <laughs> we go this way now. <laughs> In the water. In the water. We Come on, Ada. I mean, you know, Leon would be pretty good in this case as, like, a diversion. Should've got my pistol, honestly. Gonna be spiders. Eh, whatever. Fine. I didn't bring any healing. Oh my god. Reckless is stupid. Yeah, Resident Evil player, he kind of goes off on Ada. Like, no wonder she doesn't like you, dude. Hey, Reckless is stupid and dumb. And you fucking, fucking dumb. Girl. <laughs> okay, Leon. Tell me how you feel. Reckless is stupid. Douglas, the voice acting is pretty good. Leon comes across as a rookie. I think RE4 kind of built his character up to be like a superhero to where in this game he's kind of just an actual regular person, sort of. Although he's really, really apt to shooting people. Like, it didn't take him long to go, oh yeah, shooting people? That's not an issue for me, I'm Leon. Spow. Got a note. Thanks to the sewer manager. Person third Wednesday of the month, Angelica Marguerite, chief of the maintenance, will use the facilities. Be sure to reduce the moisture levels in the facility by activating the fan. Equipment she'll be using is susceptible to the effect of water vapors. On the 28th of every month, the chemical transporter Don Weller will use the facility. The chemicals we'll be transporting are extremely volatile. Extreme caution should be observed throughout their transport. On the 6th and 16th of every month, the police chief Brian Irons will visit the facility to attend regular meetings that take place in the lab. On the fourth Friday of every other month, William Birkin will use the facility to conduct a training seminar for the Chicago branch of the Umbrella Incorporated blah blah blah. As the probability of an attack upon Dr. Birkin will be high, take every measure conceivable to guard his life. You will be informed of all other potential visitors and the times they will arrive as needed. Guide these individuals to the destination safely. We expect nothing but the best from you. Charles Coleman, Security Chief, Umbrella Headquarters. Umbrella's working with the fucking Chief. Oh, well, I guess we already know that. But it's the Chicago branch, so like the New York and LA branch are coming for the Chicago branch to get their G virus. Brutal. I just read this fucking note about the people that run this place, Ada. Can the police chief irons is in with Umbrella Incorporated? Can you believe it, Ada? That'd be fucked up if that happened to us, right? Like if Umbrella was involved and you, you the crazy lady with the red dress and the gun were involved with Umbrella. That would just be silly. I don't know if my brain can handle that level of silliness. Okay, I think I got all the nice stuff. Let's leave. I'm doing good, Dark Valor. Hope you're doing good too. Leon, 
That woman was. I have to talk to her. So she just shot. Okay, bye, Leon. I'll see you later, Leon. I hope you're well. And I hope the future's bright for you, but I have to go now. Bye. A map. Why did he tackle her though? I mean, it would have been for no reason. It's okay. She'll be wherever she's gonna be. Gotta look at my picture. Why is he grabbing her stomach like that, Ada? What's 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 with your backstory? It's weird. Those are spiders. We don't mess with those. He's holding something. I don't need this right now. Then again, there's probably like extra Leon stuff over there I could have grabbed, but why, why even fight the spiders? Cockroaches! You doing good, Dark Valor? I'm glad you're doing good. Don't move. You're the one who was with that cop, if I'm not mistaken. Identify yourself. Ada? Ada Wong. Ada Wong. I've heard that name before. Now I remember. One of the men from Chicago who came to assist the T-Virus research used his girlfriend's name as his password. Ada and John, I believe. How did you know? Who are you? Annette Birkin. My husband is the man responsible for the creation of the T-Virus. William Birkin. What? John's dead. He became one of those zombies. My condolences. And although I regret this... You will be joining him shortly. I won't let anyone take the G-Virus away from me. G-Virus? It's capable of creating the ultimate bioweapon. Its potential is even greater than that of the T-Virus. Then that must mean the creature in the police department is... Precisely... My husband, William. And it's all Umbrella's fault. None of this would have happened if they hadn't tried to steal his research away from him. Okay. This way. It's sheer perfection. My precious G-Virus. No one will ever take you away from me. There he is. So you finally come. Doctor, we're here to collect the G-Virus sample. Sorry, but I won't just hand over my life's work. Ah! You might hit the sample. That's it, all right. Okay, let's move out. <laughs> Hold on, darling. I'm taking care of that bullet wound first. Stay here. Purple Alpha shit! Team, have you retrieved the sample yet? Affirmative. We'll be at the rendezvous point in one minute. Roger. <gasps> G stands for grape. Are you telling me that he injected the G virus into his own body? The G virus has the ability to revitalize cellular functions, 
What, what, what was that? Something's wrong. Let's check it out. The burble Over virus. Shoot. Eat this, you freak! I'm, I'm stopping it! What is this thing? Hurry! Oh no, not the apple flavor. What, what is this thing? Fire! And then the mice got some too. And well, that's so how it happened. Were the carriers of the virus. As a result of his virus induced transmutation, William should have lost any prior memories he had as a human by now. Even worse, every G virus bioweapon, including William, has the ability to implant embryos into other creatures and create offspring. No. Oh, get PS1 slapped. Too bad. I have to avenge my husband. I don't need this. Okay, it's for Leon. I don't need this right now. It's for Leon. Leon stuff. I uh, slipped off that gunshot. Ada? Feeling better. Oh, yeah. Going this way. Oh, yeah, it's stupid, but there's all sorts of other ways to go. No, there's not. No big deal. Just got shot through the shoulder and the lung. But I, I'm just, I'm fine. I'm fine. It's no worse than anything else I've dealt with today. Rubber bullets that cause intense bleeding, yes. Always a few bullets there, but the handgun made good work of the spider. Where's that other one? It's too dark to see what's inside. Okay. Well, I'm out of here then. Later, Red Dragon Empress. Have a good night.
clearance identification device. I need a wolf and eagle coin to turn off the doo doo water. All right. I mean, I guess it's fair. Blue herbs don't need them to get poisoned. Should have brought my valve handle. At least I know where one of those is. I mean, I guess if I got blue herbs, I can just grab. No, I'd ask if I'll use them. No, I don't need to use them. All right, let's go back. We never see Ada in the game cinematics because her model wasn't finished at the time. Damn. Yeah, I guess they did have to remake this game entirely, right? So it makes sense they'd have a few struggles here and there. Not entirely sure what I should do first, but I guess we can go back over this way and do the... Yeah, intended path. Oh, no, no, we can't. I'm stupid. I got to get that valve handle. Okay. Okay, that one just doesn't work. I was wondering where that went. I'm like, well, does that lead to a save room? No. Let's go. That was not too far of a run, really. Getting rid of the loading doors really speeds things up. I can see why that's a mod. Shotgun shells. Oh, this. <laughs> okay. water. such a cool boss that's an easy one make a gator skin parachute dumping area 
Ada. Ada. I'm gonna walk through the shit water just to get to you. Just wading through it. Leon. Oh, oh now he's hurt. This bullet wound isn't making things any easier. Quiet, Leon. I'll patch you up. I found some toilet paper in the sewage That's now to do. I owe you. Don't mention it. I just found out. John's dead. What? Never mind. Let's just get out of here. The sooner the better. Oh, we're gonna get out of here, Ada. We're gonna have to use some good old fashioned teamwork. Getting this shit water. Hey, free ink ribbons in the trash. Ada, there's treasure here. There was ink ribbons. This sewer is a gold mine. You miss Chris posting? Those are good days. this side right and then I go up sure I could save here, but I don't see the point. Doesn't look like it's gonna be too much of a run. Unless they're afraid you might get lost in here, which, considering how slow I play, it's a possibility. Yeah, you got a little bit of Chris posting his RE8. Maybe the DLC with the Chris story will do a little bit more. Resident Evil player says Annette was going to be a boss in the game because she'd mutate into a G-infected creature because, uh, William's attacking kills her, but her G-form was cut for unknown reasons. Probably time. In space. They were already, like, publishing a two-CD game. That was probably expensive for reasons we wouldn't understand. <laughs> Cheers. Well, I need that, but and shotgun shells. Wow. That's good. But what I could really use is a chest. I'll check over here just in case. 
Oh, yeah, yeah, this is where I fought the spiders. been a while since I saved. Last thing I need is for like a Windows update to pop off and crash a game or something. Okay, I guess I still need the valve handle though. Why are you looking like that, Leon? I was like, Ada, come follow me, Ada. It's porn of the G-Monster. No way, Burble Drink. I can't believe it. That's impossible. How could anybody do such a thing? Back on now. Okay. that guy the one you know the guy I guess it doesn't matter because I didn't cross that anyways right out of the way Ada follow you Leon Ada regretfully said back in the shit water Ada come on jump in we're way through the hepatitis water again did that it was good we got the silver medal and some shotgun shells i'm happy but ah here we go sir manager's diary it's been a while but i saw don today and we talked about we <laughs> i don't know if i really want you know i've read everything up to this point i'll read this too <clears throat> It's been a while, but I saw Don today and we talked after completing our work. He told me that he had been sick in bed until yesterday. It really doesn't come as much of a surprise given how long he's been working here. He was sweating like a horse and kept scratching his body while we were talking. I asked if he was hot, but he just looked at me funny. What's wrong with him anyways? Chief Irons has been visiting the lab quite often lately. I don't know what he's been doing over here, but he always looks grim. The expression on his face has been even more unsettling than usual. My guess is that it's because of Dr. Birkin's impossible request that the chief, or because of the request. The chief has my sympathies though. After he's done for, or after all he's done for the town, he doesn't deserve this. I'm mildly illiterate. 
I rarely drink because I'm on the graveyard shift, but I don't suppose I have much choice. <laughs> God damn it. I really drink on the I really drink because I'm on the graveyard shift, but don't suppose I have much choice. I don't have much to complain about since this is how I make my living. Chief Irons came in late for today looking grimmer than usual than his usual self. I tried to joke with him to cheer him up, but he wasn't amused. He pulled out his gun and threatened to shoot me. I was able to calm him down, but that guy must have some serious problems. He knows he can't enter the lab without my help and metal. What is it? <laughs> this is what it means for the chief to support. This is what it means. Oh, it's a question. I get it. This is what it means for the chief to serve and protect. William informed me that the police and media have begun their investigation on Umbrella's affairs. He said that the investigation will be citywide and that there's a possibility that they'll even search through the sewers. He asked me to suspend all Umbrella sewer uh, facility operations until the investigation has been concluded. The sewer will still be used for passage, but he stressed that I have to be extremely cautious and that I'll lose my job if anyone finds out about the operation. I mean, that's lore, but Ada, that was a boring note. I, I wish we didn't read it. Goodbye, Tristan. Shortcut. Could have had both medals pretty easy, too. So, you know. That's why I get for doing this when it's clearly a one-way door. And I have faith that it was a proper route of progress. It should have turned around, Ada. It should have turned around. Yeah, the two songs are great, but I like the one where uh Sheva says I can solve the Chris uh, I can solve the bloodline problem, Chris. He's like, oh good. Let me know when you're done fucking my sister. Hey zombies. Where'd they come from? Come a long way to turn off a little bit of water. Hey, Gaku, we're playing RE2. Leon A. We're going on a train ride. Yeah. All right. All aboard. There they go. Goodbye. He shot his finger off. I'm Leon Kennedy. I never blink. Spoo. 
Okay, I got the W box key. Why don't you shoot some more, you know? Because if they all got together, I can use a shotgun on them. That'd be effective. Oh, well. What does the map say? That's dead end over there. I want to see what it's about. Where's my shotgun? Shotgun parts. Glad it came down here. Sea shotgun. That's nice. Man, that shotgun splattered those guys. That was great. Holy fuck, Ada pitching in? No way. Oh, god damn it. Ada blocked me. <laughs> Oh, she actually saved me there. That's nice. Good job, Ada. You even killed him. Yeah, that shotgun is great. Plenty of shotgun shells, so I don't have to worry about too much more. But let's grab everything off the shelves here, real quick. I could take the magnum with me or the machine gun even maybe i should put up the pistol and take the machine gun but i mean i hate using it on you know what i'm gonna save the rest of that machine gun i got a feeling this is the combination right here that i can trust mm. 
Cashbox, I liked RE Village. I think the mercenaries mode is something that they kind of flub. It's kind of weird how RE6 has a really good mercenaries mode. And yet everything else about it kind of sucks. But I don't mind RE7's mercenary mode. It's even, it's pretty good. It's got its good points, but they haven't quite got that RE4 level of mercs that I want so badly. So where are we going now? We just straight up an umbrella facility. What's going on? You know what? I think I might want to bring the machine gun in this, the Birkin fight factory map. Let's look at, let's see what the map says. The map says this is a fight. The map kind of says this is a fight. All right, then. And they did give me Magnum ammo. They're kind of like, Hey, Maybe the big pistol. All right, I can take a hint. Machine gun's not bad because it's a middle between the shotgun. I think it'll do just fine. And if it doesn't, we'll just come back if I die. I probably won't die though. And even if I get hit, I got plenty of health. This is fine. Okay, I need a key. Okay, they're just handing out magnum bullets. I regret not taking the magnum with me. Grab these keys, go get the magnum, then come back. That's obviously what it's telling me. Although I bet he's going to come out here, isn't he? Like, hey, you got the key. No, oh, that's merciful. Let's grab the Magnum and all the Magnum ammo, too. Ought to be plenty. Okay. Resident Evil player Lud Village top five stream. Yeah, I agree. Top five at least. Mercenaries is pretty good. A little easy though is what I'm thinking. I think RE4 nailed it pretty good. RE6 even isn't too bad on mercs. RE3 is okay on mercs. Feels more like a hunk thing, you know? Oh yeah, I still gotta use a key outside. Okay, just checking. Oh, Re Resident Evil 4 Remastered, I don't know what they're gonna do. Look at, oh, God damn it. Get out, get out, get out, get out of there, Leon. I'm looking forward to Resident Evil 4 VR. I hope they, I hope they make the mercenaries mode good. That'd be fun. Maybe I use the key in the key. Oh my God! While well, push the activation switch, yes, I will. Toot, 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 toot. Good night, love venom. I hope you have a good Friday. Cutted. Can you hear me? Come on, snap out of it.
I mean, she left you to die, Leon, so I mean, what's a big deal, really? It is a desert eagle. What's on the train? Oh, he threw a pipe at me. Hey, Birkin. Close up Leon's face here, though. Look, nothing going on in there at all. He's good, though. He's fine. Man, I don't even think I needed to take that machine gun. Leon kind of gets a lot of guns. Die on me, Ada. Come on. Wake up. I took a bullet. Come you on. You just got slapped. What's wrong with you, bull cut? Get up. That really pauses my walk cycle. Welcome back. Uh, uh, hey, take it easy. We're inside Umbrella's secret lab. I'll go find something to treat that wound, so just rest here in the meantime. But Use your fur for for first aid injuries. Go. Save yourself. I told you, it's my job to look after you. But you'll be in danger if you stay with me. I know I've only known you for a short period of time. But I really enjoy being with you. I... I know I'm not capable of caring about anyone, but I don't want to lose you. We're leaving this place together. Wait here for me. I'll be Enjoy right back. Enjoy the nudie pictures on the wall. In the meantime, they're fun. There's boobies. Hell yeah, I got 50 shotgun shells. Security manual, more magnum bullets, damn. <laughs> This game has one of the better soundtracks, too. Actually relaxing save room music. Soothing, even. I could take the machine gun with me. Uh, I don't even know if it's necessary, really. 
I can save it for the boss fight, though, too. I don't know. Where's my pistol? We'll just take the pistol. I'll throw more handgun ammo at me. If they don't, I'll just use a shotgun. I got so much shotgun ammo. Yeah, I'll do. All right. Home stretch time. Okay, wait, that's the main way for what's that other door? Oh fuck, naked zombie. Well now I'm hurt. He's probably dead. <laughs> Same train. Could have figured it was a different one. Okay. I guess the game kind of moved us around a little bit without our permission. It is late, yeah. I'm I'm getting hungry, but we are close to the end, I think. I forget how close we are. Probably fold this into another one with Claire, but uh I don't think it's too necessary. Let's have a green herb. Okay, that answers all my questions. Huge breaker that regulates power, need a main fuse. Oh, thank you, Cody. I don't do homemade jerky, though. I'm sure it's not poisoned and it's fine. But, you know, I just don't eat homemade jerky. I've had homemade jerky in the past. It's fine. I need a fuse case. I got a fuse case. Which version of the Umbrella Lab do I like more? Resident Evil 2 or Resident Evil 2 Remastered? Eh, they're both about the same. Then again, I guess it's been a while since I've done this one, so maybe. Well, there's the main fuse. Maybe I need to play through this before I judge. Ooh. 
we have here? Clam Moonster. Laboratory secret manual. Security manual. <clears throat> In the instance of an uncontainable biohazardous breakout, all security measures will be directed towards the underground transport facility. In the instance that any abnormalities are detected among cargo and transit, all materials will be automatically transported from the loading zone to the designated high-speed train, at which point all materials will be isolated and disposed of immediately. In the instance of a Class 1 emergency, the entire train will be purged and disposed without any delay. <clears throat> in the instance that the lab itself becomes contaminated, the northernmost route currently used to transport materials to and from the facility will be designated as the emergency escape route. This route will secure passage to the relay point outside the city limits. Disclosure about any information regarding research conducted here or the existence of this facility is strictly prohibited. Since it's the top priority to keep all research classified, escape access may be denied under certain extenuating circumstances. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta figure out one more thing real quick. I think I need to get that. I just don't want to pick it up if I don't need it. Ah, uh, it looks like I need it. Okay, I just wanted to be double sure. All right. Here we go, take that plant. Jerks. She's a shotgun first. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, Resident Evil player heard of the infinite ammo cheat. I only heard about that recently while looking up RE 1 and 2 stuff like what do I got, what do I need to get? And I was interested to hear they had an infinite ammo cheat, you wouldn't have expected it. Colorado blend on your jerky at yeah, good spicing on jerky is fucking great. I can do it right. Okay. Staff only. Okay, I understand. The way I did that. Can't go through there. Maybe that other elevator. Since power is kind of back. A 
to play any survival games eh you know once in a while we might do grounded tomorrow I like survival games matter <laughs> trying to remember where to go I can't remember where to go to save my life I guess we gotta go back this way, but uh, I have access to green. I guess we'll go back to that room with the plant in it. Wait a minute, just to be sure I'm not fucking up. Check this. Yeah, okay, it's fine. Ever play Unturned? Nah, I seen it, but I never played it. Never. Oh yeah, I didn't check this. Plants. Ah. Hey, I can't see you. That's not fair. Need an MO disc. Which version of Ivy's plant, aka Plant 42, do I like more RE2 or RE2 remake? Uh, I kind of like RE2s more. The remake's fun, but. I mean, they're both fine. It's a plant monster. Got a lab map. Got a box. I guess I'll save here. I don't think anything bad's gonna happen, but I could use up that flamethrower on accident and regret it. Although it's pretty unlikely. I got all these ink ribbons. Why not? I don't need 
Infinity Key. Hey, maggots. How's it going, little guys? They're doing their best. Yeah, Magnum parts. Oh shit. I guess I'll just go ahead and put the Magnum together since it gave those to me. Desert Eagle. Eh, I don't know if I need the eagle on me, but I guess I'll carry it. blows off the entire top body portion oh damn it cheap shot what's going on here what do you guys do ah damn it that's on me you made me use my health no Oh no, they're gonna get me. It's hard to see. I wanted to line them all up, but that wasn't happening. Okay, we got the red key. That's good. Vaccine research machine. What kind of horrible experiments could have happened here? I don't know, Leon. Hard to say. Probably something to do with viruses. Various chemicals. Chemicals are good, Leon. I want the flame. Oh, yeah, I got it. Okay. That's good. Uh oh. Look out, Leon. It's going to poison you. It's a big moth. Oh. 
There we go. <laughs> Gotta get this weird angle and torch the little guys. There we are. Oh my god, they got a fan. Oh, it's a fingerprint scanner. I thought that was VR. Rotom system. Accessing. Your username. Uh oh. Well, I don't know my username, so I guess that doesn't matter. I don't think I got any messages about passwords. So I'm at a loss here. Hey, I love a VR set that I could use kind of like a Nintendo Wii. I mean, I know the Nintendo Wii had a lot of shitty games, but some were kind of fun. They weren't too bad. Let's see, where am I going from here? Jeez. We'll get another seven days of die stream. I mean, if you want it, if you want it. Guess password Ada, probably fuck nut. If it's that hard to find, I'll just look it up. But yeah, I need to go back here. the moth cut probably because the moth that's actually scared the shit out of people <laughs> then again they also cut giant vagina tree too so i don't know and permanently scarred. My brain's kind of melting here, but I see where I can go. Leon is not poisoned. He just got a little acid in his face. He'll be fine. At least I don't think he's poisoned. Yeah, he's fine. Throw away the card. What do we got? Thank you for checking in on that Resident Evil player because I am known to miss things like that. Damn, we got a lot of Magnum ammo. Hey, doctor. Take two and call me in the morning. <laughs> I got him. He's dead. He's dead twice. Light switch. Free first aid.
Kids good I needed them O disc. Vaccine synthesis, huh? You It is me murdered my husband. I know what you're looking for. You came for the G virus, didn't you? Take it from me. This is my husband's legacy. Now, where's that spy you were working with earlier? You know who I'm talking about. What? You really don't know anything, do you? <laughs> You're so gullible. She's one of the operatives sent here by the agency. The only reason why she came here is to obtain the G-Virus. That's a lie. No, it's the truth. I discovered this when I did a background check on her. She specifically got close to John and became his girlfriend to get information about Umbrella. That can't be. I know her. Ada wouldn't do something like that. If you don't want to believe it, I don't really care. You're about to die anyway. Wh what happened? Fuck! Get piped! I think she'll be alright, Leon. Oh my god, I dropped my lighter for the G virus. Hope I don't need my lighter. Self destruct sequence has been activated. Repeat, the self destruct sequence has been activated. This sequence may not be aborted. All employees proceed to the emergency car at the bottom platform. Okay. Let's see, where am I going? Bottom platform. Oh, yeah, I went the wrong way. No, which one's the MODIS? That's the elevator north. The Modis room must be south. All right, I just... I'd like to take in some good weapons. Hopefully they put a chest up in front of this next area because I can swap some stuff out. I don't need this fucking flamethrower. I forgot a neck getting like domed by the pipes that was pretty fun to watch <laughs> not on file okay let's just leave then i think the mo elevator's over here Purple Drinks wants to resonate where you play as a bow. You know what? They'll probably have one soon. Looks like that's what they're going to do with the uh, whole... What's her name? You know, what's her name? I just drop stuff, though. Oh. Whatever. This is a cool setup. I like it. <laughs> Machine gun time. been waiting for you, Leon. Wh what are you doing? You know what this is about. 
So just hand over the G-Virus. I don't believe this. Annette was right. About everything. That's why I told you to leave without me, but you wouldn't listen. Now hand it over. Don't make me shoot you. You can't do that. Ada! Ada! I've got you. Don't give up. G... G5... Leon... It's... over. Just... let me go. Shut up! You're gonna make it! It's... too late, Leon. We... both know it. No! I promised you that we would escape. You just have to help me out here. I... I really wanted to escape with you, Leon. Escape from... everything. Goodbye. Later, Ada. See you next week Ada! or something. Ada! <laughs> no. So, this is what everyone's been dying for. Drink it, Leon. Oh, what? Sorry. I guess I don't need Ada's gun, so... Goodbye! This way. All employees to the bottom platform. Game you play as Nemesis Rex, Mr. X would be dope. They tried that with Umbrella Chronicles, it didn't go too good. But it could be fun as a side off, you know, side game. Hey, oh, hey, stop it. Cheap shot zombies. Where'd you even fucking come from? Five minutes until detonation.
Now he's just gonna wiggle around for a while. He's gotta take a nap. Excuse me. Man, I probably ought to brought an extra health, but the machine gun was fun to use. He did it. Well, that's the Leon story, Leon A. Time for a heartfelt piano song. <clears throat> that was fun. I didn't need to grab the submachine gun or the uh, hip pouch. But giving the hip patch to Claire will probably be more worth it in the end. I didn't really suffer much for inventory space with Leon. It's been a while since I've done this scenario. I forget how long you can make the machine gun last. The point to Jesus a little loud. <laughs> Oops. Well, never mind. That counted as a skip. Okay. Well, it's fine. Don't need to watch credits anyways. Oh, look at that nice sprite art. Hey, a B rank. I guess it's okay. Four hours isn't too bad. That's a lot faster than I usually beat these. So that wasn't bad. As an evil player says, history time. Did you know that G's final form is two cut bosses that merge into one creature? That's what leads to Chris trying to make uh, Leon F his sister Claire. Wow, I didn't know. <laughs> All right, well, we got a Claire B save set up, and that's good. Oh, I can play hard scenario, too. Maybe we'll put Claire on hard if it'll let us. But that's going to be it for now. What's under special? Oh, yeah. It already has us unlocked Extreme Battle for Survivor and Tofu. We'll check those out later. But... That was a pretty reasonable campaign to do in a single night. What a good game. I love Resident Evil 2. I remember renting it a whole lot and then eventually buying it when it got re-released and then playing it now. It's been probably... I can't remember how many, more, how many years it's been. It's been a while since I've played this. But that's going to be the end. I got to go. So, enjoy a little bit of Resident Evil B-roll while I go out and play us out here. I appreciate you all for stopping by and watching. I appreciate you for chatting and helping me out and being lively. It's fun. And more than anything in the world. No. Uh, more than most things in the world. I appreciate your, your fucking ridiculous contributions and tips. Thank you for your tips. Moxie. Fuck nut. QB Shacks, Cody Nickel, and Cypher. I appreciate you all very much. You all have a good night. We'll see you tomorrow. It's going to be a big evening tomorrow, so buckle the fuck up. We'll